Well, we're here in uh, Izola in Slovenia. It's uh, April and uh, you might see the snow on the uh, mountains in the background. And you might also notice this boat has plenty of solar panels. So we're on a Pegasus 50. And uh, here's the reason for all the solar is that the boat has electric drive and that is the motor. So let's just see how quiet the drive is. So this is engage and on. And that's as noisy as it gets. And there's also plenty of power for the bow thruster. And so there also seems to be quite a good uh, amount of thrust available for full power. Well that's us cleared out of the port in Piran and we're off to sea. There's two of the best port and starboard hand markers that I've seen for a long time. Well that's, uh, that's us underway. Uh, weather's a little bit uh, cloudy, overcast, but calm seas and nine knots of breeze. We're sailing at six knots. Well, after a tedious 36 hours dodging thunderstorms and lightning and rain and everything, the sun's finally come out. We're heading towards Italy. We're in seven knots and blue sky day. Yeah, so the sails are nicely balanced. Enjoy the day. No ships around. Well, we pulled into uh, Marina Brindisi yesterday for some fuel. Stayed overnight whilst the weather settled down and uh, now we're off out again. Doesn't look too inviting down there with uh, grey clouds but there's a little bit of sun poking through. So we'll see what the day brings. There's uh, 40 knots in the Straits of Messina. Nice, uh, nice way to wake up in the morning. Four knots to 40. Well, it's great to have the comfort of this enclosed spray dodger with proper glass that you can see throughout the front. Winds up to 40 knots. And there's the sunrise we've been waiting for. Not dramatic, but nice to have. Meanwhile, we're still sailing along nicely. Going maximum 11 knots, but mostly around about 7. And there is Etna. Well, we've just come ashore now in uh, Riposto and um, find some oranges to uh, stop the uh, crew getting scurvy on the trip. And uh, this is a fantastic fresh orange stall. Excellent. Check that out. Just bought the uh, fresh vegetables and a bit more provisioning. Uh, there's the fleet of fishing vessels in the port. And we're just doing a 
wash down, keeping those solar panels clean so we can generate some more electricity and be on our way. So what a difference a day makes. There's Etna snow covered in the background, blue skies and the Code Zero out. Heading down towards Syracuse. Very pleasant sailing day. Well, today is a public holiday in Italy. So we've got everybody out in the streets of Syracuse. The Mediterranean either has too much wind or not enough. So when we arrived here last night, there was far too much wind, so we anchored. We're in Cap Passero. And uh, now there's hardly any wind, but it does look very spectacular here. Anyway. Time to get going. So we did a quick uh, pit stop in Pantelleria to buy 15 bananas. And now we're on our way again. Uh, 20 knots of wind, we're off the wind, heading north. Beautiful day. Sailing nicely today. We've uh, left Sardinia behind, just underneath the uh, rising sun back right there. And we're sailing towards the Balearic Islands, doing eight knots, plus or minus, up to nine. It's a great day. Not exactly summery weather here in the uh, Balearic Islands, but we are sailing. And uh, there's the galley. With uh, some lunch remains, and we're heading for the gap over there. And the great thing about this boat is that it's got a gimbaled saloon, which means you can put things on the table when you're sailing, and the saloon is level. So there's the chart. <coughs> Now we're on the final approach to Valencia. We've made it to mainland Spain. Doing over eight knots, calmish kind of water, so really trucking well. And he's looking back the other way. There's Ollie at the helm. Enjoying a beautiful sunlit morning. into Altea for some provisioning and this is the town of Many Steps. Steps everywhere. Some down there and an interesting staircase here. So that's pretty much the Albaran Sea completed and there's the rock, not looking too inviting this morning, covered in cloud, but we'll be pleased to get there. Well after a stopover in Gibraltar, which you can just see in the distance there, now in the Straits of Gibraltar and of course we've got the wind acceleration up to 30 knots as we pass Tarifa just down there. Nice sunny day, wind is very strong with pocket handkerchief up the front and uh, driving. Sailing 
Racing along. Good speed. Seven, eight. Waiting for sunrise. We're just approaching Trash Guys. Been beating to windward. Plenty of tacking. Window cleaning going on, and there's the fishing gear. We have actually caught the first fish of the voyage. This little guy down here, which will make a perfect meal for three people. And his next fish, similar size. Well, this is definitely a day to stay in port. We're uh, in Kashkais and it's blowing 25 knots northerly, plus gusting a bit. So uh, we're heading north, so we're definitely staying put until that's over. Well, it's a grey old day out there, but we're finally underway, heading up the Portuguese coast. It's about a three metre swell, a little bit of wind on the beam and uh, underneath there probably just see the land by Figueiro de Foz been bouncing around now later in the day the wind's piped up to uh, over 20 knots so we've got the uh, setting sun uh, reef and it's so taking us long into this kind of a lumpy sea, but uh, pretty comfortable. Well, we're now in the rainiest part of Spain, and uh, really pleased to have the luxury of this enclosed cockpit. We're in Bayona, and it's pretty grey out there. So here we are the islands off Vigo and uh, we've got the self-tucking staysail working for us today. So that works nice and easy. So from the comfort of the nav station, here's us beating to windward, doing lots of tacking and uh, as you can see on the screen here, this is our rather zigzaggy course going up through the islands. So the sail's out of the bag. We've got variable conditions today, We're off the wind, going along past a Coruña, code zero up. It's wobbling a little bit and the sun is trying to come out. And now we're just uh, approaching Santander. The electric motors are in use. Wind is zero. Well, a very reasonable sail across to uh, northern Biscay. Of course, it's raining, but there are a few dolphins around. Somewhere up there, the sun is shining. And there's Brian driving. Is that another dolphin? Come again. And the moment we've all been waiting for, a nice sunrise in the channel. From the home straight now, and uh, going well, about 7.5 knots. So you can just about see the south coast of the UK over there. Having a great sail down the channel, there's uh, about 22 knots of wind going into reduced sail, blue skies and uh, the solar panels are picking up the last rays of the sun, 100% uh, batteries which is uh, great. It's uh, also the bank holiday weekend and it's sunny, how about that? Well, the sun didn't last too long so we've got our pre-arrival wash down just passing the fairway boy 
That's the entrance to the Needles Channel. <laughs>